So the lock is a Yale night latch lock. And the problem we have is that it takes a lot of wiggling around. So what we're gonna do is change the cylinder, this middle bit, right? Leave the rest of the lock and just change the cylinder. So hopefully that will fix it. So here's the replacement cylinder, about tenner from screw fits. So that's the cylinder itself. This bit may need to cut that with a hacksaw down to the right size. Two spare keys and then the fixing bolts. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is take this back plate thing off. So sometimes there's screws on this side, in this case, two screws holding it on here. And that should just come straight off. So we take these retaining screws out. Like that. This will now be loose. With that unscrewed, I can just push it from the back. And the old mechanism should come straight out allowing us to put the new one in. First of all, we need to check the length of this and match it up with the new one. So as you can see, this one is a lot longer. It won't fit in, so I'm gonna cut it down to size to match the other one. I'm actually gonna make it slightly bigger. So on that line there, because we can always cut some off. We obviously can't add any more on. So we'll do that, check it. If not, I can take another notch off. So using a hacksaw, just cut that off now. Okay, so now we have, this one's been cut down to size, slightly longer, but hopefully that'll fit. If not, we'll just take another notch off. So while I've been cutting those, I've also coated the brass Base plate in ketchup, gave it a bit of a wash, put ketchup on it in order to try and uh, clean it up a bit. So ketchup normally works, didn't have any brasso. So in fact, what we'll do is we'll just rinse this off. As you can see, that's come up really much cleaner. 10 minutes in a bit of ketchup. There you go. Okay, so face plate goes on here. That pushes through. So we hold that, and then from the other side, we screw the two retaining screws into the two top holes, into the cylinder. Okay, so once that's tight on, then this should now, the latch clips on at the back. work in fact before we put that on we'll check the keys actually turn the lock so now we just secure the latch on 
with the two retaining screws. Check that keys work. Okay, so that should be good. So test from the outside, always make sure you've got another way into the house in case it doesn't work. So make sure the back door's open. But hopefully we give this a go and it should work. I hope that was helpful please like and subscribe and check back for more videos thanks bye